Okay, I believe this is 1970. Let me turn this volume down. 1970 Hyphotic Hitachi. I'm sure you all have seen it before. It's a battery powered radio, at AM and shortwave. And I got my pigtail hooked up to it from outside going into this little radio. This is a really nice radio, it really is. It's too bad the antenna, the original antenna was messed up, so when I put a BNC connector in here, and I just put this whip on here, it'll go further up, but I just, just enough to put this on here, so, I mean, you can still use it, you know, the antenna, or whatever, but, um, oh, god dang it, uh, moving things out of the way here, yeah, and then, uh, when you get a high, good, um, uh, you know, like a uh, a strong station, you hit this button, the light will come on. But anyways, let's see if we can get something on this thing. Let's see if it does pick up. I haven't really tested it on this antenna. Let's see. Man, the right band here. judgment of the law. So trembling and fear came as they heard the, the law being read to them. Of course they would be good with fear and mourning and weeping because essentially the law rumbled out a sentence of death. The tree in Christ Jesus Examples. <laughs> <laughs> 
hell? Kind of loose ground or something in there.
الحاجه الثانيه يعني هسه معظم الحاجات يعني اول حاجه طبعا هسه The goods and services on display include integrated design, architecture, publicity, textile, digital printing, stereography, and graphic design. The director of Genesis Galerias de Arte, Jorge Alfonso, told a press conference that even program includes conferences by Cuban experts on issues dealing with design, foreign trade, local development, among others. In that sense, National Design Prize Laureate Jose Alberto Pepe Menendez and the Dean of the Higher Institute of Industrial Design, Sergio Peña Martinez, will give conferences on the origin of the If you take this passage alone, este es también el caso del Checo Barbudo. Las tendencias de la moda de perros es mejor que se mantengan los criadores estables. for the past, I don't know, five months, and he's talking from from the bottom of his grave, six feet under, I don't know, if they buried him or burnt him or cremated him or what, brother Stare there, yeah. I think the guy's a real, I think he runs a, I mean, he's Christian and all that, I don't, I don't believe, I think he runs a cult, but, uh, 
I'm not sure what Centuria this radio is. It's a rare radio from Hitachi. I looked it up on uh, on the interwebs there, and uh, they said, well, uh, they, these are very uh, hard to find in this condition. And it really sucks when I had to put this antenna on here. The original one was all busted up, so I had to drill a little extra hole to put a B and C connector in there and then put the wire in from that, hooked it to that. But the B and C, and then this would just pop off, you know, like, you know, a connector, and then you just, actually, you know, I did this for nothing. I could, I have a connector, B and C to an SL239, it'll plug right into that. I didn't have to go through all this, but that's all right. But, uh, <clears throat> I'm not sure if this is from 1968, 69, 70-ish, um, Try looking these up, and uh, this one is in great condition, and it's got a hot receiver in it. Even on the AM mode, we'll try some little bit of AM here. Hang on a second here. Uh, it's pretty hot. It's got a good receiver. Except for the noise. Oh, metal in your desk. It's a metal desk. Always looking for the discounts you deserve. Yeah, it's hard to run it in here. Um, yeah, it's just too much noise in the shack here. I brought this outside, and I actually picked up uh, radio in Miami on AM here, and we had some skip conditions came in. I got South Carolina on AM on this thing, and the receiver on this is is hot. But uh, it's not so hot in the shack because it's picking up, uh, turn that off, it's picking up all kinds of, uh, probably for my power supplies and all that stuff over there. And uh, it's probably what's, yeah, so, but the um, short wave works pretty good. But it's weird when I touch the body of the radio, it kind of grounds itself because you know the reason why it's on batteries. Now if I convert it over. You know, kind of like, there's like headphone jacks right there. I could probably put like a small headphone jack or a DC plug right into there and run it off of, uh, you know, like uh, 9 volts or something like that. This shouldn't take more than 9 volts. And I'm not sure what kind of transistors this is. There's no MOSFET transfer transistors, of course, or... or when I say MOSFET transformer, ah, oh, jeez, that's like, that's for high power stuff. Um, it has probably germanium diodes in there and all that other stuff. I had it open before and I just don't remember. Somewhere in, in, in my videos here. But, uh, yeah. Well, this is the, uh, the Hitachi, uh, there's no model number, nothing on it. It just says Hitachi. got to be a model number on it somewhere. Oh, okay. WH888R. Uh, let's see. Use standard AA cells. I think the cells in this thing are probably halfway dead anyways. So I had it on overnight one time and I didn't help it. <laughs> but uh, this is an old radio. It's been well kept. It's in really good shape. If anybody wants to look it up for me. I mean, I know I looked it up, but I had a hard time finding I mean, I saw something about it, but I think these are hard to find in this condition. It's an uh, 8 transistor. I would assume they're uh, germanium or, or um, uh, what do you call it there? You know what I mean. Uh, I'm just a little tired right now, but uh, yeah, this is made in Japan. It's a, it's a well, I mean, this thing is pretty dang heavy. You can knock somebody out. Put this in your, in, in your, uh, if a woman had this back in the day in their purse, you'd knock somebody out with this thing. This, this whole face, 
is all metal. All this is metal. The only thing is plastic is the back. And uh, it's, it's, it's a pretty cool designed radio from uh, Hitachi there. There it is. And this is your fine tune. But anyways, thanks for watching. Please subscribe, hit the bell uh, for any in, uh, updates or whatever. I just figured I'd throw this, this sucker in here. It's hard to really see where I'm tuning because it's so dark in here, but lighting sucks. I've, uh, I'll, I'll get that improved one of these damn days. But anyways, uh, we'll, uh, ba uh, we'll be back to you again uh, maybe with some other videos. But anyways, thanks for stopping by. Uh, this is Adam Sam Radio. We'll be going QRT.